Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your uh, weekend message for this coming Friday, Saturday and Sunday, February 17th, 18th and 19th, 2023. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading. So if you are interested in your own private reading, all the information is down below in the description box below. So let's get started here for this coming weekend. What do people need to know, Spirit? Please show me. Oh, goodness me. After lack of communication and not hearing from them for quite some time, I feel somebody got discouraged. I'm feeling so it's a definite twin flame because you got two aces. That's why the, oh my, <laughs> message came out there. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Swords. So there's going to be a new start of communication, a new uh, boundary of balance. Okay, it's going to take some time to heal and be worked on here. Yeah, definitely. I feel like a lot of nervous energy. I'm feeling that they, they really don't know what to say. And I also feel that whomever is receiving this uh, communication, this new start, is also going to be a little overwhelmed. Doesn't know how to take them. Okay. Don't, doesn't know if they can believe them here. But you do have 210. So you are going to get this accomplishment, this fulfillment here. Yeah. Ooh, that did a switcheroo. So definitely communication, but it's kind of like there's a little bit of trust issues with whether or not they are legit. If they are going to, you know, uh, expect something in return and then not give it back. You know, uh, they're going to give, 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 and then ghost again is what I'm trying to say here. So yeah, not just take your time. You don't have to respond back to them right away if you don't want to. But I would look towards the future. You know, I feel there's going to be a change of heart here, okay? You can look out towards that future in a positive light way. There is going to be a change, I feel, uh, with understanding and getting through this battle here. But it's it's love. It's basically twin flame energy here, but it's a decision in regards to love with that lover's card. Like I said, twin flame, but it's really about can I forgive them? Can I trust them? Can I believe them again? Uh, and getting through that battle again uh, because you deep, deep down love them, okay? Holy mackerel. Uh, here we go. So we got twin flame big time. Do you realize how many times that comes out? Uh, not many, not right next to each other. <laughs> yes, in a complete spread it does, uh, you know, separated or what have you. But together, this is a reuniting for sure in regards to a twin flame. Yep. Yeah, T talk it out definitely. Uh, communicate here. Now you do, you are dealing with air sign energy here, but she is known for the cutout queen. So for some, you're not ready to accept them back. Uh, she, she will cut them out, you know, uh, but for others, I do feel, cause it's going to be 50, 50. Not everybody's on the same path, the same journey, you know, uh, and everybody has their own view, you know, free will, free choice is my favorite expression. Uh, I'm definitely getting a bumper sticker that says that. Uh, but definitely twin flame energy. You're going to talk to them and you're going to figure things out. Uh, it is going to take some time, but you are supposed to be with this person. Big time twin flame energy going on with the two aces and those two cards. Absolutely. So you make your decision. You do you kind of energy. I hope that this helps, guys. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Have a great weekend and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.